Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do an extreme declutter and organization of my refrigerator. So I do have a few acrylic bins in there, but I felt like I needed a few more. I'll show you everything that I picked up and then I will give you guys a before look at what everything looks like and I know by the end it will look so much better. My new motto is clear space, clear mind. So guys, this is the before of my refrigerator. I need to pick up some eggs. See, I told you I have a few acrylic bins, but they just have got a little bit messy. I have this one, which we love for the soda, and then I have that one as well. And I just need to go in. This drawer is like a hot mess. I These bags are driving me crazy with all the fruits and veggies. And then we keep our bread in this one. And then in this one, we keep, and it needs to be wiped down, it's a little dingy, all of like the cheeses and more like lunch meat stuff. There's a random orange, so I just need to get through there. And then just on our sides, I just need to kind of go through, wipe everything down, and get it a little bit more organized. Before we get started, let me just go over and show you guys everything that I picked up. So I picked up a few more acrylic bins. You saw that I do have some in my refrigerator already. Um, this one I thought was pretty great and the price is even better. It was only $4.99. And then I got one of these because I have a few of these in my refrigerator already. And this one was only $3.99 if it will focus and then I picked up two of these and they were $3.99 as well I like these because they stack and then I picked up this Lazy Susan for the refrigerator and it was only $7.99 so great prices a few new items and I'm excited to use these to help that situation. Step one, we're going to clean all new bins and remove the packaging and the sticky, like the price tags and all of that stuff. What I found that works best for this, I use a little Dawn soap and with a little bit of elbow grease, it really gets it off. So after I get all of these dishes washed, I'm going to let them air dry just a bit and then I'm going to move on to step two and step two is to clear everything out. While I'm clearing everything out, I like to put it in categories. So sauces together, yogurts together, all of my cheeses. I like to do this so I can take a quick inventory of everything that I have. Also, it makes it much easier to put things back in. And then I can see what bins I'm going to need for what area depending on how much product I have. While I am clearing everything out, I'm also going through all each item and making sure that nothing is expired or if it's at the end, you know, if there's just a little bit left in the bottle, I will toss it. And um, I know that I need to replenish that item. So I recommend doing everything, sorting it by categories so you can not only see what you have, but you can see what you need. I bet you think that I should calm down And that I'm overthinking everything about you and that we're good the way we are mm -hmm. But I don't know that much about you What things you like and what you don't It's not that long Since I met you for the first time mm -hmm. You know we should work it out You know we should work it out before I'm too invested. I should probably ask you, ask you all my questions, get to know you better. Why can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted? And will you let me down? I know I'm feeling something for you. Crazy 
what I'm doing this thing I should probably ask ya Ask you all my questions Get to know you better Why can you be trusted? Will you take me for granted? And will you let me down? Before I'm too invested You should take it easy Maybe we can do it Do you want me? And will you let me down? Next guys, we are going to dry fit all of the organizational bins that I picked up and my old ones to see how everything is going to work in the fridge. And then step five, we are going to fill everything back up. And this is where the categories really come into play because all of the sauces are together, all of the yogurts are together, the cheeses, fruits and vegetables, and so on so it will be easier to just put everything back in um, a little reminder make sure you are wiping down your sauces I know with my kids and just my husband and family everything can get a little grimy so just give everything a good wipe down and I am putting everything back in the refrigerator in categories and I tried to do from biggest to smallest so all of the hot sauces are going together all of the dressings and sauces and so forth You had me at a low Cause where you go is where I go I don't need nobody else I got you And you got me too You can ride all the blue I wanna do what you want to we can leave and run away Someday Someday done guys the condiments look much better and then over here as well and then on top I we need to run and get eggs but we have our lazy Susan with different dips on there these are like easy prep meals in the back we have more bread I don't know why we have so much bread this time in this little acrylic bin we have more dips and then our cream cheese and then yogurts and pastas that need to be refrigerated another row is behind there and then this is kind of our drink section we have lots of drinks we love bubbly that's our favorite sparkling water 
This one is, these are energy drinks that my husband drinks. And then this is some beer. And then these ones are um, like food that prepared stuff. So we have meat that's cut up for to make breakfasts and some leftover cheesy bread. This is fruits and veggies. This one is kind of full, but like I said, I don't know why we have so much bread this time, but bagels and then flat bread. And then down here is sandwich type meat and then all of the cheese, cheese sticks for lunches, all of that stuff. So guys, it looks so much better and all the acrylic bands are fitting in great and I'm just so excited about this Lazy Susan up here. Like I'm super excited about that. But yeah, it looks much, much better. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.